Today's video is going to be in the 4-6 playbook. We're going into 4-6 normal, and we're going to be using the speed package. Now, the speed package takes your number three and your number four corner and puts them at linebacker. So I'm going to show you guys right now what I'm talking about. So 4-6 normal, going once to the right on the right stick gets you into speed package. If you notice number 22 and 21, those are the number three and the number four corner. So if you go to packages, you see number 40 and number 54, those are linebackers. Again, swapped over. So in your depth chart you want to make sure that you have some fast guys right there because they're going to be playing a lot of coverage what we're going to be using is the rush outside now this beats max protect every saturday members get access to an off meta scheme i'll also go into more detail about how to defend the meta using the blitz from friday's video hit that join button below and i'll see you guys on saturday now the blitz setup is very easy it's simple it's just a baseline show blitz now the user is going to be the middle third of course you have to worry about post routes and you have to potentially guard post routes and you got to get kind of wild with your adjustments sometimes as well but all you're going to do is baseline show blitz qb contain and then slant d line outside and you're going to stand right here over the center you can blitz your user and touch up or you can just simply hold left trigger stand right here and then go ahead and get the blitz now at that time we actually only got one main usually we get two people coming in and sometimes number 94 just gets straight up ignored altogether so let's do this one more time baseline show blitz keep it contained slant d line outside this time we're going to go ahead and blitz our user and just touch up on the offensive line it's not the ball engage disengage and there we go as i was talking about number 94 gets a disengage or the guy on the right of screen this person right here is going to come in free Every single time Long Jr. is going to come in, Be even up against a blocked running back. Speaking of which, I'll show you guys right now. Block your running back. Baseline show blitz. The way contained blitzes work this year against running backs. Running backs are clueless against them. Slant D line outside. Keep it contained. You can blitz or use. You can hover right there. But this is against a blocked running back. So we're going to go ahead and engage, disengage. You can see right there, as I was talking about, Fuller loops around or long junior is going to loop around the running back it's a little bit of a delayed blitz because the angle he has to take and one of the two are going to get to the quarterback don't believe me let's go ahead and get into max protect baseline show blitz slant outside qb contain blitz or user stand over the center snap the ball engage disengage and as you see what does it do it beats max protect what happens in man defense and if you quick adjust a man assignment from zone is it dumbs out the person that they are assigned to in man coverage in this case this guy right here is manned up to the tight end and so in a way it dumbs him out to where he no longer is able to block that's just something about man defense if you didn't know about that that's been the thing since man 20 with a uh, big dime 146 but baseline show blitz slant d line outside cubic contain blitz your user and just simply stand right here engage disengage you can see right there He's coming in free now let's talk about adjustments as far as adjustments go i was talking about how you have to worry about a skinny post because a skinny post obviously this is basically a cover zero is what we're converting it to is gonna smoke this man especially if he has route tech it's gonna get bad it's gonna get dark so as we go about quick adjustments obviously you're using the middle third but if you want to get a little bit safer with this you can go ahead and take y and drop him into an inside third as well and kind of play it like this now again if they send five out you don't have to send six at them you can go ahead and again adjust with x man them up to the running back if they're not running a wheel route they tend to play a little bit better and then just blitz your user and this is just now a simple five man blitz okay so snap the ball engage disengage and you can see right there number 94 gets ignored all together and he's going to be coming through on the five man there's a lot of adjustments you have to make with this and you kind of got to pay attention to what they're running and so when it comes to adjustments again talking about the inside third what i usually am going to do is take whoever is manned up to the tight end because it's easy to use that route and drop them into an inside third because as a user it's almost impossible to get back to guard a skinny post now right here if you have, I don't even think it's possible, but if you have mid zone KO or a deep zone KO, I don't think it's even possible with these guys. Mid zone KO is, I suggest putting mid zone KO on because they sometimes actually work in deep zones. It's kind of weird. And then you might be thinking, well, what about the tight end? Again, we can change this into a five man if we want to by taking A and dropping him to a curl flat. And then if you want to shade down, you can go ahead and shade down. It is important to note that this guy is treated as a secondary. He's treated actually as a safety. 
meaning that you cannot put him into a vert hook meaning that a tight end wheel route is going to get open so if you wanted to go ahead and take him man him up to the running the tight end and pray that he does something you can do that as well with this particular one you do need to worry about wheel routes okay because this is man defense man defense gets smoked by wheel routes because they can just low point pass inside and so be aware of that if it's anything else you can generally adjust to that but wheel routes you can't really adjust to in this game but showing you guys the five man let's go ahead and we're swapping it from the side that it's coming from we're gonna get engage disengage you can see right there that time we're gonna get aaron donald disengaging and then long off of the edge as well for extra content on saturdays i'm generally looking for two to three videos every saturday and i might even start live streaming weekend league for members as well so if you guys want to drop by ask some questions or we can go into practice mode and break down the play you guys are struggling with we can certainly do that also subscribe if you guys are new to the channel that's completely free and the channel is going to continue to pump out videos regardless of what happens so with that being said this is friday for my members we'll see you guys on saturday talking about dollar run shoots and then also starting off our full updated offensive scheme out of the chicago bears offensive playbook